unfortunately, as a rabbi, I attend many, many funerals. Mm. And it's quite amazing to me because at every funeral I've been to thus far, I've only heard praises and eulogies that include so many compliments about the deceased. And I always ask myself, what happened to all the crooks of the world? Are they just, do they just disappear? Or do people change when they die? You know, we hear, while people are alive, we hear, oh, this guy's a crook, this guy's a liar, this guy's terrible, this guy you don't want to have anything to do with. What happened to all those people? They just don't die? Or, or, or do they change when they die? How come we only hear good eulogies? And I, I think that the conclusion is very simple. No, people don't change when they die. You know what happens? We change when people die. Mm -hmm. When people die, we start looking at the big picture of the other. And that big picture shows us the good aspects of the other. And then we're able to relate to those good aspects too. Unfortunately, it's, it's a little bit too late then. And I long for the day in which beloved husband slash brother slash father slash mother slash sister slash daughter and son will not just be posthumous adjectives, but, but will also be present day living adjectives where I can look at the other and say, fine, I understand you have faults, but I'm looking at the big picture as I would do at your funeral. And therefore you are beloved because I see some good points there. I see some light, even within darkness.